all around around him. I don't know why I made that voice, but welcome back to some more. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Skyrim. So, where we left off last, we were doing some of the. Oh, we get me runes razor, and I'm looking like a plub with no boots. But we get Lydia and Sophia looking pretty sexy. Sophia's wearing that, that wonderful. Uh, if you say so. It's so fucking loud in here. Nordic carved set. Okay then. I'm just gonna go down here because it's so fucking loud up there. Uh, and we talk to Astrid. Astrid. So what happens now? What happens now is you start your new life in the Dark Brotherhood. I like that. Part of the family, after all. This, as you can see, is our sanctuary. You won't find a safer place in all of Skyrim. So get comfortable. Will do. I'm an honor to be part of a family. Our family, my dearest. Our family. Together, united as one, the Dark Brotherhood can accomplish anything. But you must be anxious to get to work. I'm a yes. job, but need a bit more time. For now, go see Nasir. He's got several smaller contracts. Soon, the Night Mother will arrive. And things around here are sure to get even more interesting. Ah, oh, but one last thing. A welcome home present. The armor of the Dark Brotherhood. May it serve you well in all your endeavors. Thank you. Be sure and introduce yourself to your new family members. You're all shrouded. Shrouded armor. Yeah, that's not fucking suspicious. How much does my bow do? 71. <laughs> Where are my iron arrows at? Iron! Iron arrows! But. Let's go back to my apparel. Let's go back to my day trick. Oh, we can still wear the. Still wear this. Again, again, do the part where it tries to bite. Okay, okay, wait. Here we go. This is kind of fucked up if you will. Such a pretty little girl. Would this be like a sweetie? Oh, yes. How about some salt? Oh, yes, please, kind sir. My mom and papa left me all alone, and I'm so very hungry. I know a shortcut to the candy shop through this alley. I'm just gonna take this. support for me, right? She now. Well, as it turns out, there are a few lingering contracts we haven't had the chance to complete as yet. And more, dribbling in from time to time. I'll assign them to you as they become available. Sounds simple enough. It is, but they'll keep you busy. 
You can turn each one in as it's completed, or wait and turn in the whole group and all the targets. I'm ready for the first set of contracts. Let's get started. Your targets are the Baker Narkin, an ex Miller named Enodius Papias, and they till. When you've completed all those, we'll see if I might get some more. Happy hunting. And everyone else, while I stay home from Denver. It was good to get out and have some fun. So let's go. Let's go do all these. So we can get a proper introduction. Buddy, you badass. So we have Dawnstar. We have Iverstead. Well, we have a traveler. Let's go to Dawnstar and then we can get Irish Dead. Because it's just so close. Get out of my way, kid. Don't don't you even mess with anyone. You mind your manner, Sophia. This is a dragon. <laughs> Go figure. I kind of don't start as a dragon. What are you, Dargan? Someone is my so-called husband, Lego. Well, the feeling's mutual. I'm gonna find this fucking dragon. Luckily not, luckily everyone and their mother is not watching me. Well then, the game just crashed. Okay then. <laughs> that didn't happen. So that's two crashes I've ever had with this game. So let's get back in. Well, I've had it twice where the game the game uh once it froze on me and once it cra and uh that was the second time that it crashed. Crashed. Like, just game shut. Let's go back to Dawnstar. Uh. Well, let's go do this one and move out of here. Because Dawnstar doesn't seem to like me all too much.
You don't know who did it, so shut up. So let's go to Irish Den. Unless the dragon's still fucking here. Yep, there's the Dargan. It's a glacial dragon. Which is actually a really cool design for it. Fucking land, please. Oh, you managed to land right in front of me. Still arrow. There we go. Let's travel to Irish Den now. That's where we are destined to go. I think I'll do this stream a little bit tonight. And then see how everything goes. What the fuck? I wanted to like disable some mods? Game keeps on crashing. Give me a second. I need you to disable some mods. Mods. Okay. So we're going to disable that. The climate to Tamriel. We want Sophia. We're going to disable that. Then And disable that. So let's go back. Game needs to reload. I know. Because everything seemed to like fuck up a little bit more once I downloaded the other mod. I know. I know what I disabled. Ambience and all that shit. Are you dragonborn? So let's travel to Irish Dead and hope the game doesn't crash. If it does, then I'll have to figure out what's going on. But we will play this one out. I think my target is right there. And there's an there's a nine roots. And the final one we get to travel to the Windhelm stables. And the game crashes again. What's making my game crash? I don't have these ridiculous mods going on. Do I need to disable the dragons mod? 
Oh my god. Run for your lives, I want to keep that. Diverse dragons, let's disable that. Run for your lives, yes, I want to keep that. Let's see if that works. I just want to kill this last person and then I'm done. Oh. Skyrim's not liking all the fucking mods that I have going on. on me. Fuck. Hold on, I'm just gonna re-enable all the mods. All the mods that I have. Just to see if there's a fucking compatibility issue. So we're going to enable. 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 Yes, I know. I'm hoping it doesn't fucking crash. But those are all my add-ons. Let's load the game. Load that instead of continuing. Come on, game. Oh, is it... Is it that that makes me crash? Please work. She's really good at fucking singing and humming. For a second, I thought I saw a dragon. The shadow of a dragon. Wolfie! Wolfie! I missed your Wolfie. Now you die! I just want to kill this guy and return to the Dark Brotherhood. This game is being a pain in the ass. This game is the utmost definition of a pain in the ass. Luckily, we're almost there. So let's F5 this.
<sighs> Game's killing me. Fucking mud crab. You're gonna die. Mud crab. Okay. Let's return back to the Dark Brotherhood after saving. This is just becoming fucking ridiculous. Maybe I just had to cycle through my mods. Turn them all off and turn them all back on. I don't know, but that fucking doorway is fucking loud. Oh, Cicero. I don't know, it's beautiful. Cicero's fucking bad shit. Crazy. We all know it. This is Yes, we do. Got a contract for me? Okay. I must go to the city of Margrop and speak with the apothecary's assistant. You'll probably find her in the hag's cave when the shop is open. The girl's been running her mouth. Wants an ex-lover killed. She's apparently performed the black sacrament. Her name okay. is Nunan. I need you to talk to her, set up the contract, and carry it out. Okay. Nothing Just else? Do whatever the contact wishes. Represent us well and get the job done. We'll do, but it's gonna be the next episode. Contract, I'll let you keep whatever Muiri pays. She'll be generous, I'm sure. They always are. The night mother is inside here. I don't like Cicero at all. I am, as you say, just an innocent jester. A fool. So let's go talk to him this year. So many contracts. Good. He's dead. Having the gold? I could do this He's dead? Here's the paper. Here's the nice guy. Congrats. Here's your paper. Thank you. And there's all three. See? That was quick and simple. I'm sorry I jumped. 
come see me. Okay. So now we gotta go to Warning Never Comes. So, there we go. But uh, that's the end of this episode, everyone. But uh, anyway, guys, thank you for watching. My name is Ultimate Beauty. I'm just gonna save here. And goodbye.